Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Proxis, and I'm back with another video. This is a continuation. I believe this is like episode 14 of trying to go undefeated the whole rank season. As you can see here, we got 22 title defenses, and it's actually middleweight slash welterweight. So hopefully I get middleweight. That way I can use Israel Adesanya. But just to check this really quickly before we do get into the fight, you guys can see I am currently ranked 341 in the world division 20 i have 2004 division points and my record is 25 and zero so let's see if we can make it 26 in this video before we do jump into the fights man y'all do me the hugest favor hit the like button subscribe button, turn on notifications man i've been dropping ufc5 content well the content that ea gives of course i ain't got the game but the beta is coming soon so hopefully i do get a code and i get to play it and uh I may make videos on it. I will not make any videos showing the content of UFC 5 because I literally can't. But I may talk about not the game, but I'll talk about my personal experience with it. If I can, I think I can. I think I can get through like loopholes like that. Not that I'm trying to finesse the system, but I want to speak to you guys how I personally feel about the UFC 5 beta instead of like telling you guys about the game because I don't think I can. I think it's literally like illegal too. But that's neither here nor there. We'll, you know, we'll cross that road when we get to it but for now we gotta win our next fight let's work okay so this is somebody on the second account and this is a person that can beat me he's using wonder boy which is a very good pick and i expect this person to play very clean on wonder boy give me problems so what i need to do first off is figure out how exactly is he gonna play first off off so for the cross Playing a little bit of damage, nothing too crazy. Okay, block goes hot and it goes low. Back to the body. Nice question mark kick. So that right there just tells me that he is going to be on point. But I'm also gonna be on point myself. I'm gonna pressure Wonder Boy with the hands for sure. But I think I'm going to work his body because Wonder Boy has a really good switch stance. Nice. Nope. Okay. So you can see right now, right off the bat, that this Wonder Boy is a very good Wonder Boy. It's not to... Definitely can't take him, uh, take him lightly. see here i'm trying to play really patient i'm gonna be more locked in on this fight for sure back to the body i think we can possibly land a high kick get to think about the jab but i just want to be able to pressure wonder boy but not like not like spamming wonder boy i want to pressure him in a way where I'm taking away his space, where he can operate, because Wonder Boy works best in space. Nice little piece. Nice. Oh. Double up on the jab. You can see here he's playing on the back foot heavily. I figured he'd throw a knee there, so if I block low. Nice. That was really clean. Nice rock. Whoa. Clinching on Wonder Boy is crazy. Nice. Okay. As you can see here, facing a little bit of adversity. Nope. Back to the body. Very clean round. Very clean first round from him. He got a rock. I mean, he landed 39 punches out of 99. And I threw 57 minutes, 24. That's his round for sure. 
Something that I need to be open and looking to do is possibly kick his legs to try to win some of these rounds. If I can't, if I can't really put pressure on his body, I gotta attack what I can. There we go. Nice defense. offense right there and I can see he's kind of she tried to do the uh, tried to do the preemptive slip into the body shots I was ready for it into the body mm. nice hook counter hook at that There we go. There we go. Nice knockdown. Nice knockdown. Nice knockdown. Very nice knockdown. Wonderful weakness is his boxing. And if I'm able to take advantage of that, I'll definitely have an uh, easier fight. Yeah, I fainted the roundhouse to the body because I figured he'd throw. As soon as he seen me throw something like a roundhouse, he would uh, look to be offensive. Yep. Just keep on doing what I'm doing with the boxing. I think we'll... Let's go to the body here. I'm actually going to relax here. Not gonna do too much. Okay. Get the rock again. Back to the body. There we go. As you can see here, we're starting to get more rocks more frequently. And this is gonna open up his defense and actually make me able to uh, land more and also it's going to open up his offense where he feels like okay he's got to land something he's got to get it back right and he may look to throw like maybe a high kick or like possibly block breaking or something like that so i just got to be ready for it but it looks like he's more so slowed down the pace and he's looking to be a little bit more calculated because he's been getting, getting caught with the hands as you see here he gets caught again Oh, where did my what's the go? Yeah, he wants to get me going, bro. He wants to get me going. That was a really good round for me there. We got a rock. We got four rocks. I'm sorry. We got a knockdown and a body health event. So meaning that I did some really good work to his body. I did some really good work to his head health with the four rocks. And uh, again, we got the knockdown too. So that's definitely our round. Here we go. We got full stamina. Our head health is good. We got to watch out because we've been throwing a lot of one-twos. Oh, come here. But you can also notice I kind of got away from the kickboxing because my advantage in this fight is going to be boxing. So I'm kind of like really zoning in on the boxing because when I went for the more so kickboxing style, I was kind of getting touched up round one. So I'm looking to box a little bit more. Okay, let's give him some space. Nice roundhouse. Nice. Mmm, that was clean. Pressure him a little bit. Good job. Nice hook. Try to sway back from it. Come here. There we go. Nice knockdown. To ground and pound. That, that's what I was afraid of <laughs> getting done. To me. That's what I was afraid of getting done to me. Let's recover our stamp. Hopefully he doesn't, you know, fishy stuff. See if we can get out. 
There we go. We got the knockdown, though. It's the most important part. And I expect this guy to want to keep it on the ground. There's a reason he clinched me early. So. Get to the guard. Back up to the feet. Now, I'm not really scared of Wonder Boy hands. So, I'm okay with uh, being near the cage. But you can look at my head off. It actually isn't looking good. There we go. Another knockdown. Knockout. Clean. Clean work. Very clean work. GG's to my opponent for sure, though. GG's to my opponent. As, as I said, man, as he fights, as I continue to get to, like, Division 20, I'm going to go against guys that are... That are very good at the game. I mean, this guy had 2,300 rank points, and he's somebody on a second account. I don't know who it is exactly, of course, but Ultimate Gohan. We do get past him. It was a very good fight, and uh, much respect to him. And I'm pretty sure I had some of you guys worried in round one, um, worried about what he's doing, worried about oh snap, pry. It ain't, you know, it ain't looking too good for you. But again. You got to adjust. You got to adapt. You got to be water. And that's kind of what I did in this fight. And we got the dub, bro. We got the dub. Round one, of course, went to him. He did some really good work. I switched up my game plan from more so a kickboxing style to a boxing style. And I was able to be very successful in round two. Got some rocks. Got a knockdown, which led to a, um, a roll, right? It was a, a snowball effect, which rolled into round three was able to get two knockdowns. I was able to get two more rocks and was actually able to win the fight. So I'll take this one here. I do hope you guys enjoyed it, man. <laughs> Pretty suspenseful. Probably the best episode I've had of this series. And um, if you enjoyed it, again, as I said before, hit the like button, subscribe, button, turn on notifications, all that good stuff. I will catch y'all boys tomorrow, man. EA Sports UFC 5 reveal trailer is tomorrow, 10 in the morning. So be looking out for an upload. I was going to do a live reaction to it, but I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm just more so just going to record me reacting to it, and then uh, I'll upload it from there. But I'm out, man. See ya.